Welcome to a new video guys. So this is the side quest waterlogged. Let's go ahead and show you where we are. So you're prompted at the beginning of this side quest to be down around there where the river is. And then you're prompted a bit further up and then you end up at this dam structure here which is greyed off called Grey Catch which is green now, I'm so close to it. So that's the save point I'm at now. So find an entrance it prompts you to. Let's have a look at the quest. So it's a side mission and it's waterlogged. So I've gone follow the river upstream and then go to the lake. So I'm at find an entrance now. So this is where I came in at, this save point here on the opposite side of the bridge. So it's actually prompting you to come over here now. So this is the actual entrance. Into the grey catch, so you press triangle. Flooding so detected. Evacuation recommended. Overflow basin compromised. The overflow basin. Is that the dent? So there's a lot you're going to have to do in this side quest, so if you don't want to do it, don't do it, you don't need to. It's uh, quite complicated. It doesn't need to be as complicated as it is, but this is the way they've gone with this DLC, so let's just climb up. Looks like a control center. What happened in here to start the water flowing? So there's nothing there. Another holographic interface. There must be some kind of code. So it's a five Maybe position. I scanning objects in this area. The lock positions. Helpful. So that's the lock positions ready to go. We need the tumbler though. This is used later on in this mission. There's a collectible there. On the seat. Someone's been through here. Not that long ago either. Let's pry the door. made me. <laughs> For a moment I thought my fire was snuffed. The forge gone cold. But nope. Nope. Not old Gildan. You're welcome. Uh, wait. Start from the beginning. What are you doing down here? Ow! My apologies. <laughs> When you mostly talk to yourself, you can tell your stories in whatever order you like. There's an artifact in that storage room I simply must acquire. But as you may have noticed, the door won't budge. I took one of those roundish, ringy what's-its from the wall beside the door. No luck. So I had to go at that panel with the button. Even less luck. My gentle experimentation caused the chamber to... flood. So I push the button again, perhaps a little too enthusiastically. Sparks and smoke. <laughs> now, obviously, I came here to investigate. My... 
cautious footsteps may have contributed slightly to the collapse of a bridge. When the bridge began to collapse, I may have, for the sake of expedience, abandoned the cumbersome ringy what's it to the waves. By the time I thought to give up the endeavor, the door had closed behind me. And thusly do we come to the present moment. So instead of going through all that, I'll just skip straight to all right, I'll help. So, we need to replace that ring and get into the storage room. Then I can fix the panel and shut this place down. And I can finally wrap my fingers around that looking glass. Okay, Bilden. How are we going to get that ring? Two sets of hands, girl. Two sets of hands. Behind us lie a pair of enormous gates. But I believe the gates must be operated in tandem. Together, we can dry this place out. I guess we better get started then. I guess we better. Up ahead, girl. See the valve? Time to put our hands to use. I'll take care of this one. There's another valve on the other side to lock the gate in place. Would you mind heading across and uh, doing the honors? You know, I'm reminded of a delve I undertook out near the plane. Ledge. I love stagnant water. Charming. Don't think there's anything there to collect, no? So it's very Tomb Raider-y this, so let's call it Aloy Croft because it's uh, it's quite puzzly this one. It. A little more now, and I should be able to get the blasted gate moving. There, you should be able to lower the gate. Huh? There's the gate are. coming down. Now, when I get this gate down, you'll need to turn the valve again. Gotta lock this thing in place. So lock it. So there's around four separate puzzles on this part of the quest. One gate down. Halfway through then, aren't we? To the second yep. gate! If you're not sure where to go, just let this guy guide you. Just follow where he goes. A ladder is a rare and special thing, girl. You can depend on it to take you exactly where you need to go and no further. I'd wager the valves for the second sluice gate are somewhere above us. How are we gonna get up there? Let me look around, see what I can find. Looks like I could jump across on that rickety resting platform. So you need to jump over to this platform and then straight across. <laughs> nice jump! <laughs> nice! What am I saying? That was stupendous! I've never I seen such an absolute it. disregard for personal safety! Thanks, I think. So, across on these beams. There's a ladder there. Yep. You're right above me. Just send that ladder on down. Saves again. Look out below. Now we've done this once before. Should be as easy as falling down a hole. If you take the valve on the other side. If it's set up the same way on this side, I should look through an access tunnel. Let's just use this ladder here to go up. This, this is 
my sort of dealt. Very similar to the one downstairs, straight up the ladder. But this time there's a blockage there to get, so you can't go through that way. So if you duck down and go through this access port here, it's a little bit glitchy when she's walking through tunnels. So that's the blockage I've just got past. So drop down to go down the lead, down the ladder. Down to go through the fan. And okay, now we're on the other side. Damn thing's too heavy. Glance behind me, would you? See anything big and uh, broken? Looks like part of the counterweight broke off. If I can get up there, my weight might be enough to get it moving again. Uh, hang on, okay? I've got a plan. So this is a bit tricky this one, I've died a couple of times doing this one. So you can choose either of those pipes to run across and then you've got to climb up onto that panel there. This is why I say it's very like Tomb Raider this, because you just seem to have to keep fixing puzzles to get to the next part. So you have to engage run and jump climb up this panel and then she jumps to the next one and you work your way around can't jump straight to the canal from here well, I could climb higher but I don't know if you can see but there's bolts sticking out of that that beam there to the right hand side three of them so this is the bit that's a bit tricky because if you miss you fall into the water and it resets again so let's just try and jump over to that angle over to those bolts and then you climb up now you rappel down goes back up so now this handle I turn it. my wheel we're good to go you were sight to see bounding from metal rust trap to metal rust trap <laughs> still a bit of water but low enough wouldn't you say now uh, where's that break good question well at least I should be able to swim now snap ball it's a snap ball! Very, very big snap ball! I see it, Gildan! Fill some arrows. Very big, very, very There's big! There's at least two snap balls in here, I think. The tumbler is actually in one of these, so you have to kill them both to find the one that's got the, the lock tumbler in. 
Maybe there was only one. Maybe there was only one then. Let's just climb down this ladder. Around this corner. So he's over there. Let's see if I can get to him. I think this bit was underwater. Up this ladder. So it's telling us to go over here. Avoid that massive hole in the ground. Is there to go down. So drop to ledge. Let's just go and get the Tumbler lock from the snap mall. As you'll see there it is, the emitter at the bottom, so take all. You're right. This thing did swallow the ring. <laughs> That's the old gilded intuition in action. It's never led me astray. Sure, its chosen roots can be a bit circuitous, but never mind. To the storage room. To the spoils. Let's see what's in this room. We drained enough water for what we need to do, but I wonder if I could empty out the whole dam. So she just prompt you to empty more water out. Which is the bit we're going to now, I think. Pipes, valves. Maybe I can drain the rest of the water from here. Alright, time to get the flow going to the right place. I say this as a man typically enamored of complexities, but... This looks like it might be a little much for me. Don't worry, I think I've got this. So I don't know if you can see ears. that there. To each job it's proper tool. That make pipe is leading towards to that turbine. Those. I don't think he'll ever stop talking, so... That pipe will lead to that turbine, so you need the feed water to reach that pipe. So... It comes in here. So let's turn this first wheel. Let's turn it that way and that gets the feed going that way. So the feed's coming in. You got a and competent then, mind, girl. And then goes mind left. Nuance and finesse. Not I. <laughs> no indeed. Not old Gildan. So let's turn this one. The wrong way, turn it the other way. So that's feeding the water to there. That's not quite right. Let's turn this middle one. This job demands a certain degree of patience, doesn't it? I'm afraid I inherited my mother's restlessness. So we're coming down. We go left. And then the water goes left again. And then it goes left again there to that one. And then left again. So let's turn this one. No, not that one. I want to turn this. 
this one. Been at this a while, girl. No room to judge, mind. I won't spend half a day flummoxed by a Karja puzzle box. <laughs> so that one is now turned. If we come from this side, that one's turned left. And then that feed is going right. So let's turn this one now. So we're getting there. So let's work back from there. So it's going left and then right on that one and then underneath the other pipe and then we go left. So this one now should be needing turning the other way. It goes underneath. So dog legs under there, so we're going Something's not right. to that one now. So we need to turn this one now, I think is the last one. And that just needs turning so it feeds that turbine there. So let's go to the front. So the water feed's coming in from front. And then we go left to the second one down on this side and then it goes left again and then we go the only way it can go which is left and then left again and now that one's right and now left again and left one more time. So now we turn this one clockwise. There, that should do it. Got it working, did you? <laughs> of course you did. Never met a conundrum you couldn't unconundrum, have you? The door's open. Sure. Guess it's sealed because of the flood saves again so I'll just go through that a bit slower for you if you missed it so this one goes straight and then left un under the one that goes underneath that other pipe and then the second one down on the left goes left again and then we're going left again and then to the second one down in the middle which goes left and then we're going to this one that goes right and that one goes underneath the other pipe and then we go left there to the next one and then it goes left again there goes underneath that other pipe and then we go right into the turbine and the turbine's spinning so that's that one that puzzle completed And now it prompts us to go over there. This must go down to the lower level. Don't think there's anything else here. Nope, nothing else. So I don't think there's anything else in here. Let's give it a check. No.
So, as we circle back around to the matter of the supply room... So it's prompting up this ladder. Gildan. Soon I'll hold the looking glass in my hand. Just like Mom and I used to. Just up these stairs. Now straight on. Just follow the guide. So we're back in this room. So restore power to the door. Install emitter. And that's the that's the uh, code. Left, up, down, up, and the last one is right. So left, up, down, up, and the last one is right. There we go. There should be a cutscene now. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. And it's I saved. You lost your mind tickling the empty air like that. Data point there. Where is it? There's also a chest. Where did it go? Let's check this supply crate. All already. Pumps on left. I don't need that stuff. So the power cell is here. Okay, let's fix the panel and shut this place down. I think there's one more supply chest. What, Gildan? Everything okay? I was so sure I saw it. The looking glass. I was so sure. Looking glass? My... My old mom found one for me when I was... It was one of the last things she... I was sure I saw it. Right there in the window. Of course. Trick of the light. Nothing at all. I'm sorry, Gildan. It must have meant a lot to you. No, no. Much as any artifact of the old ones would mean to me, really. It's fine. Uh, I'm fine. Besides, what are the spoils compared to the Delve? That's why we do it, girl. <laughs> the Delve, not the treasure. <laughs> And what a delve it was! Uh, by the great blazing forge, I'll never forget that. Now then, I uh, believe we have some repairs to make. They're not wrong with no reward. <laughs> There's not a very big reward for doing this one, but I did warn you at the beginning. It's only really to complete the game if you want to do this. So this is what the power cell's for. So replace power cell. Oh, that's a whole lot prettier, isn't it? <laughs> what does it mean? It means it worked. By the forge! Ha! You are a wonder! Do you hear that often? I'll hazard a guess you do. I've heard something like that once or twice. Oh, she's modest now. 
A master of the arts of the old ones, a delver to shame the entire claim, and she wants to be modest. Ha! It's not like I did it alone, Gildan. No. No, I suppose not. So what's next for you? On your way back to the claim? And deprive the people of Song's Edge the story of this encounter? Perish the thought! <laughs> I'll stay there a while longer. But a story is best told by all who encountered it. Come and lend a hand, won't you? <sighs> yeah, all Overflow right. basin empty. Interior accessible. Minimal flood damage. Sounds like the basin is dried out too. Maybe I'll take a look. Another adventure so soon? <laughs> You're braver than me. Oh, there was no question of that. <laughs> So it's prompting us to leave Grey Catch now, so let's show you on the map what we need to do. Let's go up, so we need to leave Grey Catch and go down to Overflow Basin, so let's just mark that one. So that's the main quest we're heading for now. So this should be to complete the quest. So just be very careful when you come to this edge, as I've already died. So it's a drop in this lift shaft, so just slowly walk to the edge. And then drop to ledge. So it's quite a, a long drop. And there's no water at the bottom, you will die. Just drop off there. So exit grey catch, I don't think there's anything that we need to pick up in the bottom there now. So exit grey catch. Another cutscene. So let's have a look where we need to go next. So we need to head down to the overflow basin. Let's just flag that one and head towards it. It's easier to go on the right hand side. Because the snow's deeper on the left. So I'll cut now to the edge of the basin. So there's a campfire on the left hand side. And a trader there, merchant. We're going to find out what that banging noise is now. So you just come to this edge here. saves. There's actually four snap malls to take out. Difficult to see in the dark. Number three. Check these. It's on that one. So there should be three down here now. Must be the entrance to this den. Check this one. Be very careful around here because you can fall to your death quite easily. Just mine luck. Drop to ledge so you climb down this ladder. Then the next ladder there. Like I said, it's a long fall, so just watch out. Just 
prompting us to go straight on. Is there something there? Collectible? Yep. <laughs> is the completed side mission now coming up the cutscene so there's nothing else here I don't think where is the yeah there was that there was a collectible there so let's talk to this person you look happy to be playing again I don't know what you did but the water drained in the snap of a short song what do you think of the music I've never heard anything else like it. That's because there's no other place with such resonance, such intonation that rattles your ribs with its power. And of course, no one else knows these pipes like I do. I learned them by ear before I could walk, strapped to my father's back. Thank you for draining the waters. Not just for myself, but for my ancestors and their songs. Please, take this as a token of our gratitude. So three blue gleam, waterlog completed, 7,500 XP and three blue gleam. So that's what the noise is, it's uh, bashing these pipes. So it's just straight back up the ladder and back out again and on to the next quest. So thanks for sticking with us with such a long quest. They stretched this one out to the maximum, I think, for such a low amount of XP. Only 7,500, but that's that done. So that's where we are. It's called Deep Din, obviously after the noise that's being made. And that's where we came from, Grey Catch. So that's it, guys. So thanks for watching and check back soon. Cheers.